Hi everyone, I hope this comes out alright. Um, this is a native beehive we got here, Tetragranula carbonaria. At the moment, it's the 9th of July, so we're in, um, in our winter, I think it is already. Things are slowed up here, so I'm just feeding a little bit of pollen and a bit of propolis. I hope you can hear me alright. It's a bit windy and I've um, just on my phone. So the sun sort of comes out and goes. It's Yeah, they were out before, but they've gone back in. So I have to wait for the sun to come back out again and for the hive to warm up. But yeah, they're going good. This is a hive I purchased. This is just one of my um, first hives I made a long time ago. Look out boys. Yeah. As you can see I did it up with screws and stuff. I should have probably used uh, some hinges and other things. But um, yeah, you soon, you soon realise your mistakes after you after you make them yeah in the middle of in the middle of prepping up a garden over here i'll try and get out of the sun for you so this is sort of the hugo culture method all the sticks and base and then i've got some straw and other dirt that i've pre-prepared and had sitting around for a while Yes, they are powering on. I'll see if I can just get a quick shot. That's just a wind protector that I've put on. So I've noticed as they've come in, they're uh, they're buzzing around, trying to get back into the hive, and then all of a sudden, boom, they're blown away. But uh, I don't know how well you're going to see, guys. But um, yeah, here we go. It's a bit better. This hive is actually near doubled in size uh, since I got it. It hasn't taken them very long. You can see the nice long entrance there. Well, maybe. Let me just try and move it. Uh, you probably won't see it properly, but uh, yeah, nice long entrance. Um, and they're very active. They're really, really nice bees. And I find they're pretty gentle too. Oh. So yeah, I try not to open that too much. I just like them to do their thing. I don't know if we can see down in there. Here we go, they're just sort of starting to come out since I opened the top. Just having a little peek, a bit scared because I got the phone right up there beside me. I'll just whack this little windbreak back up that the cat seems to rub on. Yeah, got a nice little spot here underneath some nice shady pawpaw trees. You can see the frost and the cold sort of getting to them a bit. But yeah, just a makeshift fence just to stop the stop the chooks from from chewing on the plants as you can see some of these areas they've um some of the plants are just almost decimated but yeah anyway um thanks for a little look in um hopefully to hopefully i'll bring back some more um videos for you over the days over the time thank you